Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am continuing with recent events and doing another video that I have never done before. I thought that I would share with you what is in my bag. This is the bag zip it up, that I have had since just before I went to university five years ago. I went to university five years ago, last weekend. It's crazy. I cannot believe how quickly it has gone. But this is the bag that I bought just before that. And to be honest, I used it pretty much every day that I was at university. It carried my books, it carried everything. And the strap is giving it away a little bit. It's starting to look a little bit tired. But this is still my everyday bag. I tend, I've i got lots of sort of more work bags that I'll flip out here and there. But this is my comfortable, I know where everything is, no fuss handbag. So I'll start on the outside. So I always have a little clip and it's not playing games with me, but I can show you it. There we go. So this little clip sits on the attachment of my hand sanitizer. So that sits there, I've got my hand sanitizer here. Um, I always try and have a clip with me because if I'm at work and I'm decided to go with my hair down, which I do quite a lot. I know I've got it and if it's frustrating me, I can just clip it back. It's no problem at all. So there is always a clip on my handbag. Again, the hand sanitizer since COVID, that is what I've loved. I've loved having it on the outside because it's no fuss. It's there, you can use it and move on with your day. The only thing is occasionally the lid will slip off and I get hand sanitizer everywhere. <laughs> so if I move in to the bag, what I have in here is my prescription sunglasses we all know what these look like but i'm going to show you because i love them so these live in my handbag most of the time and they just clip away like that i obviously have my car keys my house keys and the other bits and bobs that i've collected over the years i still have the key ring that says that i'm 18 well they should take that off as been far too long <laughs> i have the mandatory umbrella we live in the uk it rains unexpectedly so i have my umbrella that my grand gets me or bought me i think my grand has actually bought me all of the um compact umbrellas that i have ever used so this one was very fun i've had this since my second year of uni so that is going well it is going strong Next, I have my sun cream. I showed you guys this in my summer favourites. It's just the Boots Sultan one. And it's really easy to have in there. It came, it's come in handy multiple times, um, particularly at MotoGP and the drag race. Times that you don't necessarily think it's gonna be sunny and it pops out, it's like, right, I've got some, I've got everybody covered. So I like having that in there. Uh, the next thing is my earphones. <laughs> um, these ones I bought towards the beginning of the year when I got my new phone um, and couldn't use the headphone jack ones that I had. Um, you guys might remember that I bought the rose gold pair. Um, for some reason, they stopped connecting to each other so I could only listen to one at a time, um, which is when I bought these ones. Unfortunately, <laughs> one of these ones is broken already. Um, so as much as I love the cool colors, I think for Christmas, I'm gonna ask for some better quality ones um but they do and i just use the one that i've got or the one that works um and so i've got those in my bag they always come in handy at work shopping whenever i just want to have a little bit of a break and listen to some music i have my purse with all of my cards and the little pocket for some coins and some cash um i do have a bigger wallet that sometimes i will swap it out with but i haven't quite transitioned to that one since the summer summer i was using smaller bags and not taking a bag everywhere. Um, so I liked having this more compact purse um, and it's come in handy a lot. I bought it a couple of years ago now. Um, still looks pretty good. And yeah, I really enjoy having the little card case rather than my wallet. It's not as heavy as well, which is a big bonus. Um, I still have a mask in here, um, just in case. This is one that I bought from Etsy. It's one of the origami ones and it fits really nicely over your face. Don't use it very much anymore, um, but it is always in my bag just in case. Um, <laughs> I have the Essie 
apricot nail and cuticle oil i've been using this loads i've been trying to keep on top of it my nails are starting to look a lot better which i'm really pleased with but i use this as much as i can and sometimes it's nice even if i'm at work to just take a minute do these put some hand cream on i pass it around and we order it um i really really like this and i like just having it in my bag i know where it is if i want it when i'm out because i find that if it's um dry i tend to pick at it but if it's not i can't do that so i like having that on hand just in case the last oh no highlight um, i also have this perfume in there um you can see that i don't have very much left of it um so this is the island escape um it is just from marks and spencers it's actually a scent that i borrowed um, when i went to stay with jessica one time um and i really liked it then so i bought my own one but only a small tube but again i'm nearly out of it so i might have to pick up another one it's just nice and quite small to have in my bag in case of emergencies you know what i'm talking about um the last couple of things in the main bag are some chocolates <laughs> So um, it is a crunchy caramel, aka a Twix, and some dairy milks. You will always find me with some form of snack in my bag. If it's not, you have met me on a bad day and I've eaten them all, and I'm waiting to replenish them. Um, but I always have something in my bag to snack on. Just seen also, I have a pen. <laughs> so that is what lives in the main pocket of my bag. In the back pocket here, I'm sure you can guess what is kept in there girly things and some paracetamol ibuprofen various things like that i think i've got hair bubble in there but I'm not going to go into a detail on those ones but what is in the little pocket at the front here i've got a nars creamy radiant concealer so this one is nearly out i'm nearly out of it um so i chucked it in my bag in case of emergencies i don't tend to actually top up my makeup much at work or when i'm out and about occasionally if i've got some bad um, spots on my chin i will do like we went out to dinner the other night after a long day at work and i just thought you know what is really coming through i'll put some on so i like having just this tube in here and because it's nearly empty it's quite light i love the nars creamy radiance concealer and i would love to buy another one this is the second one that i've gone through um and i need to buy a new one but yep so that is what i keep in there i have the nyx butter gloss and this one is in creme brulee this was the first one that i bought you guys might remember this one as well and i really enjoy using this i don't i haven't been using it very much recently because i've been using the um, maybelline ink vinyls but it is really nice to have in there when I, things rub off or whatever i like having it i know where it is um i have a phone charger but i don't have the lead in my bag so why i carry this around i do not know um but i got this from when i worked at hilton um and it's very useful especially if i'm going on trips or things like that i know i can charge it up and put it in and it's quite light um i don't notice it's in there as you can see i forgot it was in there and it's no point in being there because i don't have a lead for it in my bag at present um the next couple of things i have two uh, lip balms why well, i have two i don't know um but i've got the malibu lip care in tropical this is my favorite one for summer i um, mean it's spf it smells amazing it's waterproof i absolutely love this one and this one is the carmex in strawberry um i got the carmex peach and mango one um in my advent calendar last year and i have that beside my bed i use it every night and it has really helped to stop my lips getting dry and um, so i thought i'd buy one for my bag as well this one i think it has like menthol in it as well and so it's quite cooling um i don't necessarily like that um going if i could buy it again and rewind time i would just buy the peach and mango one again but that's just me but carmex is an amazing lip product especially for the winter um then i think the only things i've got left in here are hair things so i have a little hair clip in case i just want to put like a small bit of my hair and just a normal hair bubble and that my friends is it my bag is empty <laughs> um and yeah my bag is not the heaviest thing in the world it's not the most interesting thing in the world i do have a couple of different i mean it changes from if i'm working during the week to if i'm going away and i think everybody's is the same um but this is the general stuff that i keep in there there's lots of things that are sort of just in case and yeah always 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 got a snack in it but i hope you enjoyed watching this video it's a bit different and it's a bit of a 
interesting thing for me to go see through go through what is actually in my bag because sometimes it's like a dark hole in there and it's you just can't remember what you've actually put in it um but those are things that i use quite a lot and if they're not that i use quite a lot they are always great i'm always grateful for them in emergencies so i hope you enjoyed watching if you like this video please give it a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe if you would like to because i would love to have you here as always my instagram is in the description box below and i will see you guys next time i hope you have a lovely week bye